Hey guys, I want to come on real quick and share this video. Um, the topic really is very, very touching to me because I see a lot of people, and including myself, go through the same exact thing. Like the little guy always gets beat up by the big sharks, right? And all the while, the big sharks are benefiting off of the, the little sharks. But here in this video, Mace is telling us his side of the story and he wants us to know that he is tired of these people slandering his name and you know just basically slandering his name he said over almost 20 years they have been slandering his name and so he wanted to come on and, and he on his channel he's explaining it very articulately well dressed in a positive environment one-on-one -on -one, he's in the camera sh uh, sharing with us his his take on this p diddy versus maze right but he really wants to set the record straight to p diddy that he's tired of them guys slandering his name but what are your thoughts on this guys here leave a message leave you know comment share subscribe but i'm gonna um show this clip real quick um let's listen to maze real quick hold on and I think it's very great that he is saying his side of the story very eloquently. Um, and I want P. Diddy to do the same. I want to actually see them both come, come together one-on-one -on -one and speak very professionally and articulately well-dressed. Um, leave all that hood stuff alone. Sitting at a table with maybe um, somebody, you know, that we haven't seen before and who's a, who's a, a great moderator right and um just explain to us where did it start why did this beef start how did it start when did it start and what can we do to move forward okay because we don't want to see two black men beefing every day all the time and stuff not two professional men in their field very successful men you know wealthy men doing this right who have a lot of followers and stuff like that. Um, I'm not taking anyone's side. I just want to share May's side of the story. I know we've all heard of this already, but um, it's time for us to uh, get them together one on one in the you know and let all the people know that two black men can come together and discuss something professionally, articulately, well mannered, well dressed, in a positive environment. Okay. So here we go. Let's listen. That way. I cannot speak to people outside of the church the way I speak to people inside the church. I got to know my audience. Isn't that what you would say? If you're talking to a people, the first thing you got to know is your audience. And I also want you to know that the thing that's really stirring up so much confusion is because for years, these guys have organized a mass organized effort to slander my name behind, behind the scenes. So every time I say something, you just see my part because, because their part is behind the scenes. Mm -hmm. But I, I want you to know you. I'm up for it. I'm up for it. Okay. I'm anointed for it. Gotta I'm anointed to be thrown evil. I want you to know that. <laughs> so don't be worried for me. If anything, pray for me. Pray right. for pray the things for that you don't understand because I know there's a big misunderstanding between you. The first thing that comes to my mind is about how in Proverbs 18 and 17, the Bible talks about how you can hear one side and it seems right until you hear the other side. Yeah. Until it's cross reference You don't know that so much of the truth has been missing from what you've been informed about. The second thing I want to talk to you about Go is the story about Isaiah 40. What is that? Isaiah 54 and 17, where the Bible talks about in Isaiah that no weapon formed against me shall Amen. prosper. So if you see me being aggressive, Praise it's because I know no weapon formed against Praise me should prosper. God. But isn't it sad that that's the only part of that scripture people understand? Mm -hmm. The very next statement in that scripture, and, and it, it is loaded, loaded with content, content. It's, it's loaded, loaded with revelation, revelation, but the very, very next, next part of that scripture says, says and, and if any man, any man, man, any man, or any tongue, tongue rise up against you, me. You shall refute it, and that's what I did. Amen. He that's said what you something, and I refuted it. That's I pulled it down because I knew it wasn't the truth, and I dealt with him as aggressively 
as he has chosen to do it. Amen. Another thing I want to tell you, the third but not last thing, think about this. I went through every step on how to deal with him. Every step on how to deal with Puff biblically. I dealt with him biblically. That's why I felt aggressive about it. I felt like I did not have to change my strong approach. Amen. All right, guys. So you heard the side. He's strategic in it. He's the Bible. He's the most high God for his direction. And he gave him the same energy that he has been given him. Okay. And remember that when anyone comes up against you and try to attack you, you give them the same energy. You stand your ground. We have the right to, but that's his side of the story, guys. We have to hear Puff's side of the story. I know we have already heard these stories, and but we want to hear it face to face. I want to see Mace and puff daddy well-dressed mild-mannered speaking very professionally with love and humbleness and i want them guys to go ahead and make up and squash their beef and show the world that two black men can come together and make this thing positive okay hey yes that's right Peace and blessings, Black Cloud, Miami TV. Thank you for joining me. But I really do. I want to see them because I really, I, I, I believe that we all can change. Everyone has, you know, fallen short. But we you know one thing, we can change it and we can improve. No one's perfect, but we can strive for um, improvement. But that was Mace's take on it, okay? Because he said he is tired of these people. They have built up a campaign against him for over 20 years to attack him and to defame his character and his name. But he said he has the receipts. He has the receipts that he had, um, you know, that all money isn't good money. And see, he doesn't want to bring out them receipts if he don't have to. And see, I think that Puff Daddy gets a little bit of aggressive and, and, and just speaks kind of recklessly. I won't say he's on, on the um, same level as uh, Kanye West, but um, Puff Daddy can be a little bit, uh, a little arrogant too, you know what I'm saying? But sometimes you have to be a little humble when it comes to other people and respecting other people's opinions, their livelihoods and all of that, right? But we don't know the, the story until we get the other side of the stories in front of each other. We need to hear it face-to-face, uh, P. Diddy, Kanye West, Maze whoever's beefing it's best to beef in front of each other face to face all this social media beefing it, it's got to stop it's got to stop somebody's gonna get hurt and we're tired of people getting hurt okay and um but yeah guys so um distractions we are reparations now yeah we want our reparations all right and that ain't gonna never end we ain't gonna never stop wanting that black cloud as long as we have good people like you keep uh speaking about it talking about it, pushing the issues and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? One day we will get it. And 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 one day we'll, we will see it. Hopefully we will see it soon. But we have to come together. We can't be doing all this beefing against each other because that's how they separate us. That's how they keep us from getting our reparations because we're not unified. And they don't want us to be unified. And they have always not wanted us to be unified. They will still not give us our just due in any, any way anyhow we will still get the the worst end of the deal okay so we got to just keep striving stop getting distracted keep moving forward working on our goals having more than one source of income maybe seven sources of income to strive for you can do it manifest your dreams guys we got to do it and stay and keep keep fighting keep fighting for our justice our our whatever we want our reparations our land home ownership, how they rip us off with this credit and all of that stuff, guys. We just got to keep striving, though. We got to keep speaking up. That's why I always came on here, even since 2015, telling everybody to get a YouTube channel, at least put, get yourself in the game to speak up and speak out about the, the things that are going against you or, you know what I'm saying? So you can try to inspire other people to do it a different way to, you know, try it this way. Cause some, something has to give, something has has to give. Cause we're tired of our black men getting killed, murdered. We try to, we tired tired of the black family being split apart. All of that stuff, all that stuff is going hand in hand and used to attack us because it's the system is not 
for us. It's not. And it's not. And until we realize that nobody's stand, nobody's fighting for us. That's why we got to fight for ourselves, guys. For real. For real. Community. Bless up. Yeah, that's right. Community. And sometimes, it, 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 you know, sometimes we feel like we're the only ones speaking about it. But people are listening to you. You just got to stay consistent. You got to stay strong. You just got to keep motivating people and doing what you got to do. But you got to keep your mental health strong, too, and self-care because this stuff, this 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 journey that you're on and I'm on and everybody else who do the same thing we're trying to do and, di- and but we do things in different ways, but we're still doing the same thing. Like we're still trying to uplift our people. You know what I'm saying? We're still trying to keep our people in the right direction because who is our leaders right now? Don't tell me no fucking Kanye West is our leader now. Are, are you kidding me now? Like nobody's our leader but the most high God, first and foremost. But I'm talking about back in the days when we, I was growing up. I remember, you know, even though I wasn't and during those times all into politics and stuff. But I remember there were people like me, melanated people in suits and stuff, representing in Congress, representing, you know what I'm saying? And um, in places that, you know, that wasn't even on call for that people, you know what I'm saying? We wouldn't even be in if it wasn't for them people getting in those doors, opening those doors for us. You know what I'm saying? But where are these people now? I don't even hear any anybody like that. Where are these people at? Half of those people are not even on our side anymore. You understand what I'm saying? I, I don't know if I'm making any sense. I know I'm probably tired, but I don't even hear about people fighting for our causes anymore. The only people I see is the same old attorney. Every time something happens, it's the same attorney. I, big ups to him now. Big ups to him. But he can't do it all now. He can't do it all. We need more than that. We need more than one representative. We need more than one. And right now, I bet you, I bet you, I bet you, the, the people who are listening to me right now understand where I'm coming from. Like, we can't, one person can't do it all. We need people to gather up. We need our community behind us for real. We need people behind people like that, you know, showing up, showing up, <coughs> excuse me. But anyway, guys, so what do y'all take on Mace? Because um, he he's tired of people bullying him. I think um, even celebrities get bullied by each other, you know, like you wouldn't even believe, but you know, it's because they're they're going into territory they shouldn't have even been on in the first place, trying to follow behind that satanic kind of you know system of a thing, and not doing what God wants them to do, and that's being humble, respectful, and, and liberating our our people and supporting our people and helping them come up. You know what I'm saying? You know, but you know that rap game. You know, you can only do that for so long, and then you ended up have to be a either a businessman or something, an activist or something, because the people that's doing the rap now is 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 really young kids killing each other over music and what somebody said about somebody's girlfriend or fiance. It's just really ridiculous. But anyway, guys, um, Black Cloud said, "All we got is us." Ain't no leader. I know that's right. We the leaders. Amen. Collective. Okay. Maze took the oath. Oh, yeah. And 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 it ain't no taking it ain't no taking it back. You can't un untake the oath. So maybe that's what it is. And they're gonna continue to target him, huh? You think? Get on here. Um John my live. Were y'all scared of John? Oh bronze. Y'all used to come on here. Were y'all scared to be on my show now? Come on now. Yeah, let's talk about this thing. I got to go to work in the morning, but hey, it is what it is. I really don't even want to go back there no more. But um, but I got goals, you know what I'm saying? So listen, click that live and let's talk about it. Black Cloud. Ain't nobody scared. <laughs> I know you're not scared. I'm just messing with you. But yeah, so you said you said Maze took the oath. Why? Because of money and fame, huh? That's why they be taking that oath. Or was it something where a little bit deeper than that? 
because y'all know what they were saying about P. Diddy's, you know, being a little zesty. I don't know. Maybe something about those receipts is not just about money. I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, guys, but my opinions is my own. And, um, you know, it's no, I'm meaning no disrespect to anyone, but I'm going to state my opinion. I have the right to do so. It's freedom of speech, but I'm not trying to harm anyone as, as well. All this stuff is alleged, but I just want to show May's side of Point, point of view, but P. Diddy's already said his point of view, and I just want to see them come together. Hey, hey, Black Cloud, Miami. Yo. Hey, how you doing? Blessings. Yeah, what's up? Bless up. I'm good. Yeah, long time no here. But listen, what's your take on this? Have you been keeping up with this? I mean, I know it's many, many, many topics that is very important in our community, right? We don't, we can get to that too. But when it comes to two brothers beefing on on social media, grown men beefing and won't come together, you know what I'm saying? To to squash the beef. What do you think about that? What as far as a mason, a puffy? Mm-hmm. Mason, you think he a Mason? Yeah, Mason and Puffy, Macy, yeah. Mason and Puff Daddy. Right, yeah, yeah, Puff Daddy, Diddy, all that. I mean, you know, as far as that, there's like it. It don't really draw a lot of energy to me because it's like a game that's going on. You know, like to me, it's, it's just to me. Uh huh. It's like it's a game that's going on. You know what I'm saying? And they like they want us to get into all the, even with the con yeah and all, i'm really starting to understand like what's going on it's a game like you uh -huh. know they're trying to get us like to get into but as far as the mace and the puffy i mean of course puffy fucked everybody i don't know if, i don't know if i can if, you know if i can curse on your channel yeah, but yeah this is mature audience right here this this yeah 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 bless up black power what i'm just saying like that's what puff been doing you know that's puff that like that's what he do he did it with the biggie he did it with me, all that. Of course, he owned money and all that, right? Yeah. Oh, he, 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 you know, of course he do. You so, know what I'm so saying? But they, it, they couldn't get to where they were unless they signed and took the oath and, and then went in the back door. Well, of course, I, I mean, at the end of the day, you know, I'm, I'm a part of a group called Lost Tribe, you know what I'm saying, on, on certain levels. So I know the industry, but like dealing with me, uh, they wouldn't let me get up in the industry like that, that because you know I'm real vigorous out here, and I I know what time it is. But yeah, of course, like Mace, yeah, he did it. He went through the industry all that there, you know, and uh, like like whenever you sign them contracts, uh -huh. a lot of those contracts, yeah, they have a lot to do with it. Eat like like even to today, those different contracts or whatever. So of, of, of you know, of course, yes, but at, at, yes. The, yeah, at, at the end of the day, Mace because he you know we dealing with uh, everybody want to get views. Everybody uh -huh. want to get you know all this shit. So of course, Mace gonna come out. Everybody want to get they love. It, it seems like everybody is not everybody, but certain individuals they like they want props and they want attention or something. I don't know what's going on. Like everybody yeah. want attention because yeah. I, I can easily like I'm you know on, on my channel Black uh -huh. Cloud Miami TV. I can easily do the attention things and yeah. all the beef. I, I can easily touch that, and you yeah. can too, and get my views up. You see, uh -huh. but I'm not on that. Maybe you can easily right. do that. You know, right. and, and a lot of that is like, you know, it's real. But you know what? One thing about you, Black Cloud, I like how your, your content is. I like you. I like your persona. I like everything about you because you ain't going to back down from your opinion. You know what I'm saying? Like what it is, is what you believe. And, and you gonna, you got, you know, you're a man, you're a black man and you got that strength in your voice. You know what I'm saying? And what you're doing on your channel. I love it because you give little clips in different aspects of where you know wherever you are you know what i'm saying you're gonna sh you're gonna tell us about the people in your culture in your in your community you know what i'm saying exactly exactly like right that. you don't re even realize that you're educating us like for real for real like you don't even see this this could, your your channel could be on a television show like on national already TV. Yeah. You know already, already that's what i enjoy about it yeah, and, stuff. And, then you bring, and you bring entertainment because you have that aspect in you. You know, yeah. you've been in that world before. Yeah, I'm gonna deal with the music. I'm gonna deal with the Miami music. All that. They're all. I mean, like all over everything. Like, it, like, like even tonight, I got a lot of things I want to deal with. The Kanye on my mm -hmm. channel. You know, and I want to get into the scriptures because when he went in and said about the Jewish and all that, the Jewish feel like they Jewish. 
Uh-huh. That mean like they wish they was Jews, but the real Jews, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying, is us. We don't want to play Israel, the 12 tribes. Like, you know, I don't right. want to play with them. Like, it's real dangerous, like, right. dealing with me because I, I didn't peep all the levels. So right. I, I know in the scriptures it say uh, those who say they are Jews, they are not really Jews. They're mm-hmm. actually from the side of Satan. Right? right, but they say they Jews, and I don't want to get our channel shut down, so I'm gonna chill right. because I don't know what level you are. I don't give a fuck. Right. Me, I don't give a fuck. You know, I'm black cloud. I don't give a fuck. Mm-hmm. Hey, but I, I can go and deal with them with it. Yeah. So I well, know what the car shut us down a long like time ago. But you know, they try to do it. You know what I'm saying? They send little subtle hints. I was um on what what they call it uh uh shadow band whatever for seven days. I couldn't go live. I couldn't comment. Yeah, I peep that. I peep that. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. It, I don't know if it was me that really did it because I fought it, I appealed it, I lost. You know what I'm saying? But all it was, they 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 hit a video that I was just playing music. I just replayed the song, and they got right. me on that, saying you can't do that or whatever. But I don't know if that's true or not because I be seeing people doing all kinds of shit on YouTube. That, and, and, and look, I be playing music. They don't never there. They, they, it'll be a copyright claim yeah, or whatever. But they ain't never really. They, well, hold up, but check this out. They ain't never really strike me. Only time I got strike. Was in that that Whoopi Goldberg, that Whoopi Goldberg. It was uh, something that went on, and I said something about it. Yeah, I had a fair con up there. I had a a, a a Nick Cannon when he was with a uh, like Professor Griff. Like, remember Nick Cannon said some shit. Remember, yeah. remember Nick Cannon said some shit about the J Wish. Yeah. I'm gonna just say the J Wish. I don't want to get our channels knocked down. Yeah, right, but yeah, yeah. We were yeah, just uh, mentioning that Miss Hart was mentioning that on my um yeah. last live. And um, yeah, I can see that they will try to shut you down. I mean, but that's suppression of us because we're not out here suppressing them. They out here saying all kinds of shit about us, but you don't see us shutting them down, do we? Yeah, no, no, no. But we can't. All these things: YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. These are different institutions. They are private, and they are owned by a lot of the J Wish, you know, J Wish people or whatever. So they could do what they want to do. I don't mm-hmm. care. See, my thing is, if they strike me or take me down, it make me feel good. You know what I'm saying? Like that, I got you. You know what that I'm saying? So, if, if I, hold, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Check this out. Sorry. Now, if I was doing uh, the Lil Wayne, they say Lil Wayne ain't doing good. His birthday. I just, I've been on the M Rec. I watched M Rec because of you two. I'm gonna yeah, shout out to M Rec. I did that because of you. You have, you understand that? That be me in the cloud. That be me in the in the bushes all the time. You feel me? Okay. I just be chilling though, right? But at the end of the day. All that there, so now we 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 understand like 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 what's going on, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So a lot of them they it don't really matter. It, it's really a war, like uh-huh. the YouTube and face. It's a war because Ashra Quasi, respect Ashra Quasi. He always say sometimes the bird don't want to come out of the cage, mm-hmm. so you got to go in the cage and get them. So that's yeah. what I do on this Facebook and YouTube. I I ain't never like it. I ain't never like YouTube or Facebook back right. then. They like, to get on. I ain't never like it because I meet people outside in their face. Mm-hmm. I don't be on no, I don't want to be, I meet on my side in their face. Yeah. But since some people, okay, that, yeah, so that's what's up. So I'll come in these, but it, it's just a mission to drop bombs on them, you know what I'm saying, to keep it pushing. It ain't mm-hmm. really that serious like that, like, like to me, it ain't really that serious. You know, I drop right. different it, vibes. It's not, but, because really yeah. all, both of them are, are, I would hate to say this word, but agents, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Both of them are agents. And, that's um, right. And, but the thing is, they're trying. They're they're affecting our community. They're affecting our culture too. So I just want to talk about it. You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like like basically this beef and shit got to stop for real. Twenty years. So yeah, but here, here's what it, here's what it, I'm gonna be real with you. Right, I don't mean to cut you off. No at problem. the end of the day, at the end of the day, right? A lot of the beef, and I'm I'm down here in Miami, right? Mm-hmm. I didn't interview with everybody. Mm-hmm. On, all, on all type of a lot of things y'all ain't never seen because I ain't never posted. Right. But I mean, like, I talk to the youngest, like, yeah, what's up with the black on black killing? Like, I'm gonna be real, like, don't play with me, soldier. Mm-hmm. I'm not on that shit. Don't mm-hmm. play with I need to know what it is, what's going on. And one brother said, uh, yeah, well, you know, uh over there on uh he was on 70 some street and he said over there on uh on 40 some street, they killed his uncle back in 1980. I was like, huh? Dang. So that's why y'all beefing. I'm like, damn, nigga, you fit. But see, it's okay. Mm-hmm. So we know as elders, like a lot of this shit is way back shit. Y'all uh, thinking, no, yeah. oh, he say somebody killed his uncle over there on 40 something, so we don't like them niggas. Mm-hmm. We don't like them niggas. That's right. So they beefing over shit that happened years and years ago. You see? Yeah. 
Yeah. You, know, you, you understand what I'm saying? I see, yeah. Yeah, it respectfully, makes... you feel me? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. So I didn't never really think about it like that. Like, oh. Yeah, it's a, whole, it's, a, it's a whole lot you don't know that's going on out there. And a lot of people don't know. You know what I'm saying? They don't wonder. I'm glad I'm able to get on here because a lot of times I ain't got a lot of gigabytes. I ain't got a lot of because I, I I be wanting to go along with it. I don't even know how to go on stream, y'all. I'm gonna need you to help me. I I, I, I sent you my email. You ain't never get in touch with, but I I need oh, some help. Sorry, be real. I'll put it on the line. I yeah. need help, man. <laughs> I got yeah, something to say. You know, you I'm looking. I must not look. I'm not looking at my spam. They must be putting in the spam because I checked my email. My brand. I don't even know what spam is. I don't even know what. Oh. No, I ain't email you. I ain't email you. Oh. No, you know what? I I text you. It was something I would text you my email and I text you. I think I text you my number. It is what it is, but you know, at the end oh. of the day, you know, we on we, we, we on the movement out here. We trying to move with the vibe and we respect all the vibes. And I'm I, I'm gonna say this here because we live right now. I don't know who could be. You know, I can't see the chat. I don't know who then came in. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So, so I'm Angie saying. said. So Angie came in and hello, so Angie. Thank you for coming okay, on. Okay, that she was a bless up. She said, absolutely, at Black. They are owners okay. a lot of industries. That's Professor right. Griff That's isn't phased by talking about them. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. Right. So I, I just want to say this here. As far as, like, what we dealing with and as far as, like, the gods, right? I, I don't really like to say the word the gods, but, like, the gods that we deal with. I did, I do this. I did it before. Ain't nobody catch on to it. It was vigorous with it. But mm -hmm. whatever gods we deal with, right, mm -hmm. as so-called black people. I'm going to say Aboriginal because like, the black, they said ain't good to say the black, whatever. Mm -hmm. But as the Aboriginal guy, it, it, the, the thing we deal with, mm -hmm. what's the nation of Islam? What's the name of their God that they deal with? Can you tell me, please? I'm going to do this here and I'm gone because I'm vigorous out here. You feel me? And I get my channel together, my okay. shit going to be here. But go ahead. Okay. What's the name of the nation of Islam, God? Allah. Isn't it? I like Zach. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. That's good. That's good. I lie. You're right. You, you, you correct. What's the name of the Rastafarians? The, the Rastas. What's the name of they got? One is Ja. Aha. Uh -huh. There you go. Chill, 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 chill right there. There you go. <laughs> That's right. Hold on. And then the Hebrew Israelites. The Israelites. That's right. Yeah. What's the name of they got? Yahuwah. Yahuwah. That's right, Yahuwah. That's right, yeah, that's right, yeah, that's right. Yeah. And then if some people deal with it, deal with the Kemet, which is easy, but whatever, because I peep all the levels. So the Kemet, uh -huh. who's the god of Kemet? What's the name now, of the god of Kemet? I don't know about Kemet too much, but Pharaoh. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I got you. I got you. It, it, it ain't no big thing because I ain't even on it, but the name of the god of Kemet or whatever, or the leader of Kemet or whatever is Amin Ra. That uh -huh. Ra, right? It's Ra. It's Ra. Uh -huh. And then a lot of these brothers, they deal with the Buddha. End of the day, I'm just showing you that the ah, ah, mm -hmm. Buddha, Allah, Ra, Ja, Jehovah, Yahuwah. What's up with the ah? I just want to do that, then I'm good. I'm good, Queen. I yield. Yeah. Yeah, what's oh, good? Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, they always understand because they play a lot of games. Like if you righteous, you righteous. If you foul, you foul. That's just what it is. It don't matter which one you subscribe to. It's all the collective vibe. And even family who listen out there, even your body, your body is a collective. You got your kidney, you got your heart, you got your lungs, you got your liver. Everybody doing their job. It's all about the collective. You feel me? But I noticed that and I feel we've been tricked on certain levels. Everybody got the art. I like all that there. And I peep all these different religions and shit. I all these that Jehovah's Witness, that's Charles Taylor Russell, the Mormons, that's mm -hmm. Joseph Smith. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. All the uh, uh, uh the Seven Day Adventists, Ellen G. White. We up under a lot of different spells and cracker shit, and we tired of. And I'm me. I'm just here to break the spells. That's it. Yeah. You know what yeah. I'm saying? That's it. Yeah. My bad, tired. Queen. My bad. Bless up. No, that's all right. We need that kind yeah, I'm of. I'm tired of this shit. That. No, I'm talking about, yeah, I'm, yeah, we tired of this shit. Mm -hmm. No, but hey, I'm gonna be real with you. I'm gonna need you to show me how to do the scream, y'all. It's okay. I will. I how will. Stream, Whatever you want me to. I mean, it's best. Um, you know, anytime after like five, six o'clock, I can do it. Um, we can do it right now. I can show you for real, for real. It's all good. No, it's all good because I want to. I want to talk to you, but you, you know, behind the scenes. But okay. I'm just saying for for everybody out here, it ain't no games out here. You know, right. it's like 
it's real and, and, and I respect like the target individuals like straight like they don't understand like they be shining lights in my house. Yeah. Like from helicopter. And all, all I could do is think about like the target of individuals. Cause I, I kind of fought that a little bit. Okay, mm -hmm. target of individuals already thinking like I'm already I'm a black man in America. I'm already a target of individuals. But when that shit like I got pulled, I got pulled in the daytime because they say ain't had no lights, you know, like all type of different things. So I peep, Let me tell you about it, what, uh, like what they'll do to a, a target individual, a person who, who is an enlightened individual, who's very um, a chosen one. God put his is just a specialist on this person. You know what I'm saying? And 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 you have an empowered mind and very strong minded. You know what I'm saying? That's what a, a, they they feel threatened by those type of people. Some of these, some of us are coming here to to this world already with these special gifts is just that we don't we don't know how to pull it out of us right but then all of a sudden you're starting to walk into your purpose and then you end up just into your purpose and you realize damn i've been i'm waking people up i'm doing i'm you know i'm doing things that these other people should have been doing many years ago and i'm at this age doing this you know what i'm saying so these people get threatened by people like that. You know, they'll they'll hold an apartment for a targeted individual and and stall it out, and then they're setting up people next door to them to move in next to the target individual so they can harass them all day and all night and do things while they sleep and uh, you know just all kinds of shit. So you won't you think you're moving in on the first, but then they're like, oh, something's going on. You got to move in on the tenth, right? But all the while, within that first and the ninth, they got this uh, these new people coming into the other apartment. They they done held to, and now these these stalkers are the ones living next door to you because they held out your apartment, made you move in after you know they do all kinds of tricks and shit. I'm right, telling right. you, you just got to be alert, aware, and stand your ground, people, for real, because these people are they know who we are. They know who we are. And, and until right. you know, and, until they know who you are, and you know who you are, you know what I'm saying. You're gonna be tricked every time. You got to get on it. You got to stay alert and aware, and know who you are, and know whose you are. You know. Right, right. Uh, yeah, I hear you. On your ground too, because fuck that. You know they fucking yeah, with yeah, you. Yeah, 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 yeah. I hear, I hear, I hear. You got to stay on your ground. Yeah, at the same time, I, I I agree with what you're saying. Everything is right what you're saying. Mm -hmm. We still have the prior ideas. You so. know how many news, the news that we don't hear when our brothers get gunned down by white uh, white people or any other race, it's a lot of that shit get covered up. You know what I'm saying? We don't even hear about it. They don't want us to hear about it. But they out here doing that shit. Right, 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 right. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah, I want to say bless up to the people. You know? Yeah, I want. Yeah, I want to say bless up to the people. Now, I ain't one of them ones who you know, hide behind avatars. You feel me? That's why I respect no. you too. Hold, hold, hold up. That's why I respect you too, because you always, you know, you always got, you know, we got our face on the scene. Uh -huh. at, at the end of the day, like, like when Moses, you know, mm -hmm. what I'm saying when he went to the everybody wanted to go up there and talk to the Most High with him, and it was like, you know what I'm talking about. Y'all yeah. sure y'all want to go talk? You sure you want to go talk to the most, huh? You oh, sure? Yeah. Uh, you sure? Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying? So I had to, you know, yeah. I, had to, I had to do it like that, though. Thank you. Thank you for coming on my channel. You know, thank you for yeah, all bro, the great bro. work you be putting out there, man. You know, that, that takes strength. That takes, you know, you know, just straight up, like, tenacity. You know what I mean? And and right, we need right, that. Right. It's just the thing is, we small channels. You know, we're the small channels, and a lot of people don't really get a chance to to hear about us and to hear about what's what we're talking about either. It really does, you know. And and the thing is, they don't want nobody to hear us. That's why we get like this. They they shadow ban our channels too. But you got to keep moving forward. You got to keep posting. You got to keep going out there and doing what you, you're supposed to do. Because God is leading you. That's the, that's the most important thing. God is leading you. Man's not leading you. God is leading you. 
And I appreciate you guys for stopping by and listening. I just wanted to come on and talk about it. I want to hear somebody else's perspective on it. Am I the only one thinking like that or what? Am I by myself when I think about stuff like that? I don't know. But I'm just, I'm seeing and I'm not. And people are just afraid to say it and speak out. And, you know, that's just how I feel. But I'm going to still continue to do my videos. Uh, I just like to do a lot of different stuff on my channel. And maybe that's why I don't get the views or whatever. But I know this channel is being suppressed. But I'm going to still continue to do and and talk about the most important stuff. You know what I'm saying? Because it's a lot of people. It's people all over the world talking the same stuff we're talking. It's just that we can't connect because we are being suppressed. They don't want us to connect. They can't. They try to do the little shit to keep us from connecting. You know what I'm saying? It's, it, it used to be a lot of truthers. It used to be a lot of people who talk about black issues and stuff like that on these social media streams. But they suppressed them so bad. Like they took their channels. They shadow banned them. And they even in the real world going out there targeting them because of these the same stuff we talk about. You know what I'm saying? That's why you just got to stay prayed up because God is on your side anyway. You know, God is on our side. He He's walking. He's pushing us through our purpose. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, what's up? Bless up, you hear me? Yet. Bless yeah, up, you hear me? You dropped out for a little bit. Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, no, it's all good. Of course, they're gonna do that. But at the end of the day, like right as far as like. All the people like everybody's like I'm gonna be real with like like dealing with the scriptures and I ain't even on the scriptures like that there, but I was happened to be blessed to deal with a lot of the, I, I didn't deal with all of them. You know what I'm saying? All okay. of them, whatever they want to do, it, Islam, Buddha, all that. I didn't it, all of them. Okay. So what I'm saying is like when you dealing with the, uh, you know what I'm saying as far as being like. Hello, I can still yeah. see you. Oh, yeah, 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 he's breaking the vibe. But as far as like uh the uh the different religions or whatever, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? It's uh, you know it, you know it's all been a setup. It, mm -hmm. You know it, it it's all a setup. It's all a setup, and it's all like a gang. You feel me? Like all the it's a gang. Uh -huh. It's all a gang, and it's, yeah, it, it, it's all to make us do that. But at the end of the day. We, we ain't gonna need everybody. I ain't gonna. I had lost my thought, but I just got it back. You feel me? Tell them black power. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Power. But it, it, yeah, yeah, yeah. But as far as like that, there. As far as like everybody on some people was on it, nigga. All that there. It ain't about. It, it, here's what it's about: the people who really own it, who gonna really fight on it and stand on it. Of course, mm -hmm. it's gonna be some that come in and they peep it. Like, okay, I'm gonna talk to the individual. They peep it. They see mm -hmm. what they and then they get ghosts. Of mm -hmm. course, that's what it's gonna be. Yeah. With the post, but the ones who are truly on it, like like for example, like me, right? Yeah. Only only you can see me good, like yeah, me, right? Perfect, perfect. Yeah, like me, right? Like me, mm -hmm. like I ain't celebrating to all the sisters out there, right? All the mm -hmm. sisters, you want to all the sisters? Shout out, I ain't sisters. No, I ain't, yeah, hey, look here, I ain't put no Christmas trees up. There ain't no yep. Thanksgiving, no Halloween. Yep. Like you understand, we ain't on none of that. Yeah, none of that, and I'm I'm outside yeah. right now. You feel me? Yeah. I'm outside Miami. We, we live. Yeah. But yeah, we ain't on none of that. We ain't on none of like you feel me. So yeah. that's what it, you know. I had I had to get that's what things change. That. You understand? I had to I had to break that programming too because I was listening to the brothers and stuff like that, but I was still being conflicted with what I was raised. You know, as Christian Baptist, you know, we did all of that crap, all yeah. of that. Right, right, right. But at the end of the day, see, I'm laying down, but you don't want to be on screen. You can hit stop cam and then you click here. You create a, you can um, have a thumbnail that's already on your laptop, save it onto your downloads or whatever, or put it on your um, file drive or whatever and download it. And then so that way, when you click it, you can just select it from your files, your picture, right? You can mute it. You can put your name here. And then you can come on to the main screen. Add your thumbnail to the screen. And this tells you like how many people can be on the screen at the same time. Like if I just want to be on myself and I'm not letting nobody come on. It's just me. Video. And you can share that link. Copy it and share it to your page or to your email or whatever. That way you'll have it. 
you know. But yeah, guys, I'll do a better video because I'm just, I've been, it was a long day dealing with different personalities. You know how that is working from home on a computer with hundreds of people on the computer with you looking at you. You know what I'm saying? You looking at them, they looking at you, and you're trying to listen to the information, and people keep interrupting. So I got a headache already, but I'm pushing through. But God is good. And um, I just wanted to come on, guys. No, you know, I just really appreciate um, So Angie and Black Cloud Miami and Miss Hart. I really appreciate you guys for supporting my channel and watching my videos and, and, and just showing some love and showing and sharing your perspectives. Because everything that I say, I'm not perfect. I always say I'm not perfect, but I'm just striving to improve. I'm listening. I'm learning. I'm watching. Um, you know, heeding advice, you know what I'm saying? Trying to do better, just trying to level up, trying to, you know what I'm saying? Get my reparations too and trying to help my people get their reparations too. That's why I talk about sources of income and having at least seven sources of income. Why not? The rich people do, you know what I'm saying? But like, like Black Cow said, and I said too, you can't take this stuff with you. But for right now, you might as well go get it while you can, because God wants us to be prosperous and fruitful and multiply, you know? So on that note, guys, I got to go. Peace and blessings and enjoy your night.